Good morning, Yushi. I knew it. Um, Dad, you know... I hear you're going to be home all day. Cube was telling me. What? You're not? You're going out? Uh, oh, no. Well... Uh. I'll be home. Don't you worry, Dad. <laughs> Oh, Q. Uh, is there something you need? <laughs> What's the big idea telling Dad I'm going to stay home all day? I, I'm sorry. However, Master Gunbart is hoping to celebrate your birthday, which only comes once a year in the grandest fashion. But that's only going to make mm. me feel worse. How many times do I have to tell you? Then please go and tell that to Master Gunbart, not me. Anyway, just stop him. I, I would, but Master Gunbart asked me to go into town to get some things for him. Are you going to do about it? I'm terribly sorry. Sorry just isn't going to cut it. I can't go to the castle with a soiled dress. Yeah, she's right. Don't think we'll let you off just because you're a kid. <laughs> well, cut it out. <gasps> Yushi. Ha! Huh. We need a kid, we'll ask you. Why don't you <gasps> shut up? No one's going to care about a little smudge like that. It is not that simple. Just so you know, we're on our way to the castle to meet with the queen. You're meeting with the queen? Right. I hear the queen has requested to meet with a whole bunch of girls from all over the city. Oh, could it be? Is she looking for a partner for the prince? If that's the case, then it's almost a certainty that the prince has returned to the castle. Not that this has anything to do mm. with a kid like you, mm. Yushi. <laughs> So, 
This is your first time to the city, Kokolu? Yes. I'm sorry to have caused you so much trouble. Oh, no. No trouble at all. But you were great, Miss Jushi. The way you told off those grown-up women. It was so cool. I really admire your attitude. Oh, it's not what you think. You see, those girls and I are all the same age. Huh? I may not look it, but I'm really 17 this year. And yet, as you can see, I have a 10-year-old's body. <laughs> Is that a fact? I wonder why. I don't know why. Some tell me it's a witch's curse, and others say it's God's anger. Whatever it is, I've stopped growing. Hey! Mm hmm? Is there something you want to be when you're all grown up? When I'm all grown up? What do you mean? I would like the opportunity to thank the Prince. A long time ago, I was saved by the Prince. That's why. Though it seems that lately, the Prince is hardly in the castle anymore. That's the rumor that I heard. Lady Yushi! <laughs> Lady Yushi! Master Gunbard is longing for your immediate return! And why is that? Didn't I tell you to stop him? I couldn't do it! Not after I saw him preparing everything so joyfully! <sighs> Sorry. Guess I gotta go now. Well, uh, I guess I don't know exactly what to say, except maybe... Good luck, Miss Yushi. <laughs> oh, thank you. It was nice to meet you! I'm supposed to eat all this? You know how disheartened he gets when you leave anything. Um. Uh. Now then, Princess, the preparations are complete. Uh, say, Dad, you know... Hmm? What is it? There's something I've wanted to tell you for some time about my birthday. Your birthday? This year, I'll tell him I don't enjoy it. I have to do it. Hmm? Uh, I can't do it. Mm. Thanks as always. Well, shall we eat now? All right. So, let's all eat our hearts out. <sighs> Ready? Let's, let's dig, dig in! in! Uh, I'm not eating till my birthday next year. You did great, Lady Yushi. Because Dad just looks so happy. Besides, he's taking care of me even though he's not my real dad. It's the least I can do to repay him. Huh? Jin? What are you doing here this late? Huh? Come. Are, are you crazy? Master Gunbard will punish you. It's fine. I did something nice for Dad today. Hey, wait. That doesn't mean just go do what you want. I'll be right there, so wait for me. <sighs> Hey, I'm heading out. I'm gonna go fetch some late-night bird eggs. Oh, thanks for all your hard work. Ah! Hmm? <clears throat> hmm? 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 Uh... Man, don't scare me like that. He almost caught you. <laughs> I'm sorry. Long time no see, Yushi. It really has been a long time, but oh my, how you... Uh. How you've not changed one bit. You had to say that. 
I would like to thank you, Yushi, for taking good care of Jin while I was away. By the way, did you take part today in the audience with Her Majesty? Audience? It's where you meet someone of high rank. Oh, yeah, right. I heard about it. But she wouldn't meet with a kid like me. How can you say that without having gone? You might have even had the chance to meet with the prince, you know. Yeah, I guess you're right, but... Child, there's no way I'd get through. Are you positive about that? Huh? It's my understanding that through these audiences, Queen Ercel intends to select the Platinum Princess candidates from those she meets with. Platinum Princess? I've heard of it. Huh? Something about a legendary princess in the Eternal Tiara. The human world, the heavens, the demon world, the spirit world, and the fairy world. Containing the magical power of these five worlds, the Eternal Tiara is said to grant any wish made by its wearer. The Platinum Princess is the one who receives this Eternal Tiara. It is said she must possess a heart worthy of the Tiara, and she only comes along once every 1,000 years. Uh, any wish at all? Then... Mm, with the magical powers of the Tiara, you may be able to undo the curse you live with. I can... I can become an adult! Up close, it really is majestic, isn't it? Well, yeah, Aircel does happen to be the biggest country in this area, after all. Wonder. Oh. What's the matter? Y Yushi? Everything's the matter, that's what. We heard it was an audience, but when we got to the castle, they told us to find the queen ourselves. Did you meet her? No, we didn't. Nobody could find a trace of her, even though we spent the whole night searching. <sighs> Lady Yushi. Can't we just go home now? <sighs> huh? Step no further. Children are not allowed here. Lady Yushi, let's let's go back. I don't think it's a good idea to enter the castle without permission. But... That light! Huh? Cube, come on! I want to go there, I have to! But they just told us children aren't welcome! That's why I'm asking you! Please, Cube, that light is calling me! But... but I... Please! All right. Uh, didn't I already lend you a flying magic item? What happened to that? Oh, sorry. I kind of lost it. What? That was expensive, you know. I couldn't help it. It just went flying off on its own. Oh, really? Man. Madariatsa das parifa lilkaitis. I want two pairs of swallowtail shoes. Can't you make an exception? I'm on a tight budget this month. What? You only got one pair. Then that's all they can give us. 
We'll have to make do with what we've got here. Isn't it a little small? Hey! Be more careful with it, will ya? Like this? <sighs> wow! This is awesome! <laughs> Lady Yushi! No time to play, let's move! It's my first time, I can't help it, okay? <laughs> okay, let's go. H hang on! Don't rush me! <laughs> How's this? I think I got it now. They'll see us for sure at this height. We'll have to fly higher up. What? Even higher? No! Ah! Lady Yushi! Hang on! Halt! Who's that up there? Hey, you! Come down here! Not good. Time to move. Somebody do something! Please, show some dignity! Me? The shoe's the one doing all the flying! Wow! A hallway made of marble. Incredible. Never mind that. Let's move it. I don't know what I'd say to Master Gunbard if they caught us. No, wait. Hold it. Uh. This way. Hey, wait just a sec! Lady Yushi! A young girl. Yes, ma'am. We're chasing her down right now. There's no mistake. We're almost there. Found her! <gasps> what do you kids think you're doing? Thought you could slip out from under our noses, huh? Man, you're just shameless! Hey, you! Come back here! <laughs> Lady Yushi, hurry! Thank you, Cube! I really owe you one now! Stop right there. <gasps> if anyone other than the Platinum Princess were to touch that tiara, she would surely lose her life. Queen Aircell! Seeing as how you got this far, I assume you were guided by the light of the tiara. Mm -hmm. As I expected. What's your name? It's Yushi. My dad and I... I am the daughter of a hero gunbard. Gunbard. What? Well, what's wrong? Nothing. <gasps> what's this? Proof that you are a Platinum Princess candidate. Platinum... <gasps> Who, me? But you are only a candidate. You must work hard in order to obtain that power of the heart which is suitable and necessary for the princess to have. Your goal is to become the Platinum Princess, said to come only once every 1,000 years. There are many lessons you must learn, and your training will not be easy. If you're not sure that you can do this, you'd be better off turning back now. Please raise your head. <sighs> well, Yushi, <gasps> I hereby acknowledge you as a Platinum Princess candidate. The best of luck to you.
This week, a warm-hearted story about a father and daughter began. What will happen next time? Come on, Dad. I'll be at school, so you'll hardly be there at all. What? You've made your dad sad. Next episode, Arrival, Yushi goes to school. What? Arrival? Just call your dad if you run into trouble.